I'm Johnny from Expert Boxing. Right now I'm going to talk about how to retreat. This is an important skill for beginners because beginners are always, you, you know, usually getting beat up. They're on the defensive side, getting beat up by bigger opponents or more skilled opponents. And this is how you retreat and defend yourself effectively and efficiently. So, first rule is to never give up more ground than you have to, okay? If you have an aggressive opponent coming in and he throws a big punch and for whatever reason why you can't defend it, easiest way to get out of the way, one step. That's it. You take a step, you're clear. It doesn't matter what punch he throws, you take one step and it all clears. But the thing you have to remember is not to give up more ground than you need. So if he throws one punch, you take one step, a little six inch step, small step, that's it. What you don't want to do is he throws one punch and you run halfway across the ring. Okay, don't do that. You'll run out of space and next thing you know you're in the corner taking shots. So don't give up more space than you have to, okay? And if you do it right, if you do it right, you can avoid a whole combo, okay? You're right here, then the moment you feel two, three punch combination, take one big step and everything he throws will miss. Second rule is to never give up more position than you have to. So for example, let's say I really have to move, okay? But I don't have to move all at once. If he's throwing a head shot, I can move my head first, then on the second shot, I move my whole body. Or let's say he's throwing a body shot, I step back first, on the second shot, I move, I, I collect to the new position. Okay, so you move your head first, or move your body, or move your feet, okay? You don't have to move all three at the same time. Now the key thing is, by not giving up your position all at once, you can have more movement with less space. You can have more defensive room to move. Okay, so for example, let's say with one step, I, I can, I'll show you how I, I would avoid three punches one step. On the first punch, I look away. I turn away. Second punch, I take a step. Third punch, I collect. I'll show it to you sideways, okay? Punch, punch, punch. And I avoided three punches by doing that. Now let's say he's throwing 20 punches, okay? 20 punches. Tilt my head here, tilt my head here, step over, bring my feet, look back, step over, move my head around, back step. And if I, if I keep moving around, Okay, move my, my body, then my head, then my feet. If I keep moving around, I'll, I can avoid many punches using very little space and I'll never run out of space. The advantage of doing this is that you can avoid more punches using less energy. And you also make it harder for him to chase you down. If all you do is just back straight up with your hands up, that's too easy. He's just gonna come forward and fire punches. But if you keep tilting around, shifting, changing your angles, doing this, he has to swing, he has to keep repositioning himself, gather his feet. When he misses, he falls past you, he falls over, and he uses more energy to chase you down. So that, those are the two most important rules. Don't give up more ground than you need to, and don't give up more position than you need to. Okay? Hang on to your stance, hang on to your ground. When you retreat, retreat two inches at a time, use your pivots, use your turn, natural movement. Okay? Don't just stand here like a block and, and that won't do anything. So anyways, Work on this, use it when you shadow box. I don't, re I don't recommend retreating for every defensive situation. The only way to really fight back or to really defend is, is to counter back. Okay, but retreating is good for, um, you know, if you're tired, you got a cramp in your toe, your nose is bleeding, you can't breathe, you got something in your eye, or you're already winning the fight and you don't want to get caught by something big, retreating will keep you alive until the bell rings. Other than that, Get back to punching. Thanks for watching.